one. Go ahead and say this really quickly. Um, okay, first off, let me say, I can say certainly that for a very long time, a very long time, I've been literally sitting over here minding my business, not giving nobody no time of the day, not like just paying people does. Mama said, okay, I'm getting off good. Thank you, so I can speak freely. But you know, you gotta have a certain level of respect for your mama, okay? Huh. So, let me go ahead and say this real quick. Um, I have been choosing to take the high road and ignore all the little shady stuff and the little shady posts and all the little shady shit, because my mama should be off by now, okay? Um, I've been choosing to be there, but let me make something very clear, okay? And I'm saying this because I'm sure that the little fake profiles are watching anyway, so you see me. Let me make something very clear. My choosing to be professional, to handle my business, to ignore you, does not negate the fact that I will whoop your ass, and I mean that with everything in me, period. Now, you already know I've pulled up on you before. Before. And let me say this to the people who are on the whole, like, this ain't nothing about no man. Let me be very clear about that because I done got a couple of DMs. Like, this what he want. He want women fighting over him. This ain't got nothing to do with no man at all. I gave that up in 2020. This is 2023. I left him in 2020. Ain't been back since. So it has nothing to do with no man at all. I don't care about him. Don't want his attention. I don't need him. Don't want him. It has everything to do with, as a woman, why do you continuously think that you're going to keep coming for me? Why do you think that? Why do you think that? Why do you think that? And any woman on here that's been in that position, I'm talking to you too. If you have been messing with somebody's husband and they give that man to your ass, take your ass on and live in Everland, Neverland, Everland, happily ever afterland. Go on and do your thing. Live your life. But to continuously, continuously try to keep coming at the once then wife that you was sleeping with her man, <laughs> her husband, that is whack, lame, and I'm not here for it. And listen, let me say this. I know some of y'all are like, but Mel, stay on your throne, you're a queen. And I'm still a queen. And I'm going to be queen when I finish doing what I got to do and say what I got to say. I'm going to be a queen after that, before that, during that, and after that. I've been posting business deals and business stuff in between the mess on my story for the last two, three days. That ain't going to stop. That's not stopping. But what I am saying, y'all, is people have to learn to leave well enough alone. Quit bothering people if they ain't bothering you. Don't bother folks who ain't bothering you. My auntie just came on here. Auntie, go on and get off this live. My favorite auntie just got on here. Go on now. Exit. Exit. Don't bother people that ain't bothering you. Period. And this is what I'm on right now. I don't care. I really don't. I don't care. I don't give a shit. It don't matter. It's I'm on what you on for real. It doesn't matter because I don't bother nobody. I sit over here, mind my business, handle my kids, all the little snickery, little, it, it, little childish shit that's been happening in the past few years. I have been ignoring. I have been ignoring. So can't nobody come over here telling me what to ignore. I don't want to ignore nothing. No more. You know what I'm saying? No more. I already did it. I already did it. I don't watch. I know y'all didn't think that I was not going to come back. Because I'm back. Just like that. Now listen. My point is this is what I'm saying. When somebody's not bothering you. Yeah, I'm back. When ain't nobody bothering you. 
Who was that? It wasn't nobody. It was my phone. When ain't nobody bothering you, leave people alone. Leave well enough alone. Like, at this point, didn't you get what you thought was the prize? Like, didn't you get it? Move, move along. Like, move along. Didn't you get what you thought? Right? You got that, right? You did. So move along. And listen, folks got to learn to leave people alone. Because people, everybody has a breaking point. We all can try to do right. We can all try to, you know, when they go low, we go high. I already said you go low, I'm going to hell. And what we're not going to do is we're not going to have the you thinking that you're going to just keep none of y'all. I don't care. Not just not just her. Anybody. <laughs> you're not going to keep thinking that you're just going to keep talking shit and Mel ain't going to respond. Because Mel will respond. But when I'm ready to. And I'm ready to. Okay. Bundy Blue is on here. What's up, Bundy Blue? And I'm ready to. So don't get like don't get the whole business male professional pretty mail twisted because I will beat your ass. And that's for real. Back down. Leave me alone. Mind your business. Quit throwing little subliminals because everybody ain't slower than a fifth grader. So people can read through subliminals. Because every time you do, I'm coming to Beyonce's internet. And I'm coming for your ass. Every single time. Now I said what I said. I'm done saying what I got to say. Y'all can keep following me. Watch my story. Watch my page. If you ain't here for the drama right now, if you don't want to be doing that right now, you might want to unfollow me for a couple of weeks. Because I'm not sitting in silence. I'm not sitting in silence. It has been so much happening the past few years and I ain't said shit. And you think it's finna keep going on? Oh, no, ma'am. No, ma'am. Uh-uh. I'm on what you're on. I'm on what you're on. Petty me petty. Like Dom Dumb met Dom. Okay, so let's go. Love y'all, and I'm gonna holler. Now, y'all, what the hell that happened? I was just sitting here minding my business and burning up, and now I got to come on the internet and see Mel about to whoop a bitch ass. What the hell is going on here? I'm telling y'all, you keep on poking the bear, and it's gonna end up pouncing. And she done got poked and prodded quite enough. I done told y'all several times that <laughs> Gator Mouth is going to continue to write checks that her ass cannot cash. And Mel already done went up there with the uh, warriors to her door several years ago when she first told her to leave her damn husband alone. Now, she done gave them to her on a silver platter and she still keep on messing with her. This little girl, she's not going to get it until she get it. Okay, and now Mel, don't you go out here with nobody ass now, girl. Well, that ain't worth it. You ain't, ain't nobody about to be going to jail and get no charges pressed on them from whooping nobody ass now, child. So you you stay on in your big beautiful home and live your life like it's golden and leave old Gator Mouth ain't got nothing to lose alone. Okay, cause all she's doing on the internet is talking a bunch of nonsense and nothing, and it's a bunch of do bads on her. <laughs> on her instagram listening to her say god knows what because none of it makes any sense ever she's on there wasting listen if we had to pay a bill for internet time we should have cut her off a long time ago because ain't no way i would be paying not one gigabyte to listen to her foolishness and the people that do god speed because you you need a wing and a prayer to have enough time to be wasting your time like that but you like it i don't love it mail girl girl gone to the courts mail we know you big mail you better say the big okay child comment down below what y'all think mail over here about to whoop somebody ass child and i'm here for it <laughs> Matter of fact, let me know when you go with my ass mail. I might come over there and help you out, allegedly. All right, y'all. <laughs> Peace out.